And we're back. Now, as I was saying about... Actually, let me see if I can hit these guys. Uh... Ooh, Blast Burn. Can I hit him? Um... Ooh, it's tempting. It's tempting. Very tempting, but I'd rather hit those three, so I'm gonna use a Starfall. Ooh, and I made a good call. Samuel Adams. Always a good decision. Yeah, speaking of which, I could use some Samuel Adams. That would be awesome. It's like the second best beer I've ever had. But anyway, back to Crusader. Um, the game itself is its more about who has the best defense versus who has the best offense. Because if you have a crappy defense, you're fucked. But if you have a crappy offense, well, you just have a crappy offense. Alright, how much is this going to sting for? Oh, I might want to move uh, the Baron. Baron! Because that flying guy might be able to hit him. In fact, I'm actually counting on that flying guy to hit him. Yep, thought so. Oh, and Schnickerdoodles, I've moved him. Courses. Oh, but Vlad to the rescue. Buckler. What does that do? Crits invisible that has damage over one turn. Actually, I think I will. Oh, I can't use it on him. Damn it. Damn it, all to hell. Finally, use a fucking herb. You mother cluckers. Get the F out of my way. Get out of my way. Ooh, nice goggles, though. Um. The units I typically use in Stronghold Crusader were the Crusader Archers, the the um, the uh, Knights I would use on occasion. I think they were they were good for raids. Um, the Crusader Knights or not Crusader Knights, the Crusader. Uh, oh, what are they? Called? Oh yeah, Swordsmen. Duh, they're just called Swordsmen. I keep thinking of like Stronghold Two, where there are actually unmounted knights and then Swordsmen, where they kind of like made swordsmen weaker, like significantly weaker, and they made these knights, like, basically the equivalent of what the swordsmen were. Swordsmen are fucking beastly, but not to the point where they're, like, rig-tarded, where it's impossible to fucking kill them. Um... What else did I use? Oh, mounted archers. Mounted archers were, like, the best archers to use for assaults. The on-foot archers, they're not that great. As far as defense goes, they're amazing, but as far as offense goes, no. Even when it comes to, like, holding positions that are away from your castle, because archer, uh, mounted archers have that mobility, because they can just run and shoot, which, in a way, kind of made them lame. And there really isn't any other unit that's as fast as them, which Stronghold 2 had the right idea in adding the ho ho hobulars, I think they're called. They're basically light cavalry, but they are slightly faster than the horse archers. And the purpose of them is to kind of make it so, you know, mounted archers aren't, you know, they, they don't have free reign to run all over the place. Um, on occasion, I would use fire throwers, but they were only good for, like, if you can amass a lot of pitch. In which, in which uh, that's how you... I cannot fail in my mission. Hiya! But it, that that's actually a resource that's not very common in Stronghold maps. But it's it's cheap. It's easy to just buy off the market. Um, hit these two with a Starfall. And what he he would <clears throat> he would use mounted archers, but he didn't use them as well as I did. And then he didn't really. Actually, he was pretty damn masterful with his uh, siege equipment, like his catapults. They, yeah, he could lay into my walls pretty good, but I was still able to like repel him because I used a mixture of archers on my wall and then mounted archers. So basically, you had two big groups of mounted archers just going at it head to head. Um, all right, let's attack with Maria. How long has this mission been going on? It doesn't feel like it's been very long. But we've already killed like half of them. Then again, they're using pretty damn old weapons. I mean, they've got like wooden shields for crying out loud. And he's got a wood shield. A stink. A stink too. That's interesting. Alright, so let's open up this chest. Let me check the guy and see if there's any other goodies here. Nope, that's just it, and there, and it's a balloon is in there. I got a balloon! Yay! I'm happy now. I got a balloon. 
Alright, actually, as a kid, I didn't care much for balloons. Alright, I can use Dragon Stab. Damn it! Seeing if that could. I was seeing if I was actually doing two guys. Do it. Whoa! 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 Oh! Oh! Yep, that's on. That's that's been recorded. That's that's going to YouTube. Oh! <laughs> wow! I don't feel like talking for the rest of the video now. <laughs> oh my god, that was horrible! Horrible! It's 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 not what it looks like. I swear. All right, Baron's been fully healed. All right, so who's all who's left? I know there's those two guys. Oh, that's it. Just those two guys and the magician. Nice. Um, who was it that needed healing? It was you. You and you get healed. All right, children, line up to get healed. Oh, sh I forgot you have that ability. See what you guys did. You made me talk about random games, then I talk about, or actually, I don't talk about it, but, uh, you made me say something I didn't want to say, I might want to go with healing them, and then I get hit with this freaking shine storm. I blame this all on you. My subscribers, it's all your fault. Okay, fine, it's my fault. It's my fault. What does Felicia want? One moment, folks. Got dramas. All right. Sorry. Had to quickly, although that took me a bit to respond. Okay, let's move Yori. Let's move straight to Yori! Holy crap, that was a quick response from her. Um, I'm not gonna get to that right off the bat, though. Alright, now this guy... Oh, well. As long as Yuri's not getting hit. Oh! Oh! No, oh, wise guy! But yeah, the guy that I played against in Crusader, uh... I don't really remember how it is that I beat him almost every time. There was... In fact, every game we did multiplayer on, I ended up beating him. Oh, wait. Can this guy hit him, though? Oh, my God. What's his agility? 50. There's a chance. There's a will. There's a way. Ooh, sweet. Healing. Go. Who? That was too close. Alright, little fairy children, heal my guy. Oh, guys. That guy had like 5 HP he needed to have healed. And then I should be able to kill both of them with that other guy I haven't used. Ooh! He said, fuck your couch. All right, star for all these fools. Feel the wrath of God. Wow, it's not like a freaking Satan is saying that. <laughs> Irony. Oh, and I believe they are both. Well, actually, yeah, he's dead. I don't know if that other one's dead or not. Okay, he didn't quite die, bastard. Oh well, at least there's no deacons. It's always the bright side, there's no deacons. I appreciate this deaconless game. However, wherever deacons may roam, Dolan will be there. Whoa! Oh, I was gonna say, when the hell did fucking Starfall get such a big area? Well, that's what I should have done, is put that damn book on him. And down the bombs go. Fifteen? Well, that was lame. 
Alright, can I hit him with her? I can. Alright, and then Vlad, I just need you to move over out the way. Hell, I didn't really use Vlad. Or Maria, for that matter. Or did I? I don't remember. I don't... I, I don't remember. And guilty leveled up. Very good. Yes, yes, good, good. Very good. Actually, it's Maria. Okay, I definitely used her because she was level 12 last time I checked. Yeah, is everybody at least level 13? Poor Vlad. Poor General Vladimir. Turn in, yes. Alright. Now Zen. Move back there and I'll just attack him with you. Oh, with you. We actually tried playing Riddler 2 together, like he he favored the Allies, but I favored the Soviets. Oh, we had some epic matches we did. That was actually a game where we fought as equals, I would say. That was one of the few games besides maybe Age of Empires and Age of Empires 2 that we fought as equals. We had a right massive fight in that game. I mean, holy shit. We're, we're talking like grand scale battles that actually caused... It almost caused the game to crash. Like, there were multiple times where we thought the game was going to just genuinely crash. Oh, who's texting me now? May the Lord's benevolence shine upon you. Oh, well, thank you there, Yuri. Hey. That's it is. It is me. Whoa. Whoa. This hall is dangerous. Maybe it's better to secure our escape route first. There must be a back door somewhere. Let's try to find it first, shall we? Okay, let's separate again. Just a moment. I found something. What is it? It's a weapon. It's really powerful, especially against living things. Better take it with you. But how about you, Barry? I have this. Zip. Oh, Barry. Okay, I'll stop. <laughs> Can you play? Okay, okay, I promise I'll stop. That, that, that is the end of it for this video. No more Resident Evil quotes. So, Yuri, you were heading to the mining prison. Do! Oh god, the Pope's in this. I will say, though, that the Pope we have now is, I mean, he does look like the straight up devil. I mean, I'm not hating on the guy at all. I think he's a genuinely nice guy and everything, but <laughs> he just, you know, he's got that look about him like, whoa. Okay, so Yuri's a treasure hunter, basically. New discovery at the mining prison sent up to luck ring to St. Nirvath. So this is a very important job for me. Alright, so we're both headed for that mining prison, so we rescue friends, he collects his goodies, and we're all winners. We are. Well, uh, um... That's what she said. But Yuri!
Okay, so he still thinks we're affiliated with the West. Or at least that the Baron is. The church has spies. Not much of a church then, is it? If it's, you know, meddling in people's affairs. Well, not meddling so much, but observing. Well, I suppose actually that is kind of smart. You don't say. You don't say again. Ah, I'm guessing he's trying to expose the corruption. Because the Cardinal is pretty corrupt because he is taking more power than a Cardinal should be taking because the Church tries to maintain neutrality, but because the Cardinal sort of took a high political stance in Natra, it kind of made the Church... Yeah, see? Well, how doesn't it not? How does? Er, bleh, can't speak. Change in leadership, maybe? That'd be my guess. See why not? Oh, but breaking it would be so much more fun. But fine, we'll do it the smart and safe way. Well, it's the porn music. That was pretty skillful. Here he is a pretty intuitive guy. So he saw the politics that were actually at play. But at least he's not quite... Well, his faith isn't diminished, but his faith in the church is. Because he sees it as, you know, just another political group. More so than a religious group. Because they're kind of using the religion to sort of increase their own, you know, power. Which, hey, what a shocker that a church would do that. So what else is new? Alright, so we're in Sadie Town. Let's go to the shop. Oh, how does my laptop? Eh, not too bad. Alright, we shall bind the equip weapons. Weapons? Thuffer and Thuckatash. Claw hook with sonic wave. I will take it. Alright. Whoa, we almost have a hundred thousand. Nice. Okay, nothing new there. Mandrake still the latest and greatest. A rapier. I'll take it. 
Uh, villain. Nope, still the latest. I don't like the villain either. I think it looks kind of dumb. Ooh, we have kites. And we'll buy him a high herb. El Doggy! El Doggy is still the latest and greatest. Be iron with a hurricane. Stand back! There's a hurricane coming through. Yeah, I'll take it, even though it lowers his weight. Oops. Um, there should be a new staff available. Oh, there's two of them. Ah, poison, I don't care for that. Shine Storm, though, I will take. High Boom. Is there a new one of these? Nope. And for her, a rap... A rap... Rapier? Is it, is it ra rapier? Rapier, that's it. I almost got it a raper. <laughs> Imagine that, a sword called a Raper. I wouldn't be giving that to Yuri, or Yuri, <laughs> Maria. Now, I can't buy anything for Yuri, he kind of just functions on his own. That and he's stuck at level, whatever the hell level he's at. What does the balloon do? Oops. Increases luck, actually, I'm going to hold on to that. Um, ooh, glove. HP plus 9. I don't know how a glove increases HP, but whatever, I'll roll with it. Alright, so we're good on herbs. Or I can sell that. Anything else I need to sell? No, I don't need to sell that. Sell the... Oh, no, I don't want to sell that either. Yeah, I need to upgrade. Or not upgrade, but adjust everything. Now, what does that have? Balloon bomb. Puts the target there and makes it explode. Actually, that's kind of a crummy ability, so... Yeah, I think I'm going to wait before I get any of my special weapons up and running. Alright then, so we shall transfer our stuff. It's whip. Oops. Start from the top, work our way down. Holy jab, dragon stab, and razor wind. Or actually, no. Yeah, I'll lose razor wind. Thunder slash and blaze slash. Now the reason I keep both of these is I think because of their effect they're more effective on certain enemies like uh, if, there's a if there's an enemy with a resistance to electric damage then I'll just use blaze slash and the same goes for blaze slash if they have like fire resistance. I think that's how it works. I could be wrong. Okay, uh, he had a buckler. I think they all have the same abilities. Yeah, they do. I'll give him that. That. Barry, I don't care much for, so. Ebony Mark and Ghost Queen. Oops. Tau. I'm gonna give him Heal Light and Starfall because Blast Burn. I don't need Blast Burn if I have Shine Storm. And the reason I keep Starfall around is because it covers a smaller area, so if, like, my allies are condensed with the enemy, I can just, you know, use Starfall and still hit the enemy without damaging my own guys, because there is friendly fire in this game. Just so you all know. Cover mark. Oops. Oh, well, that works. Oh, yeah, he didn't get anything new. I don't want weapon trade. I don't care much for bear. Actually, yeah, I don't care for barrier. Is there any other abilities I could snag? No, there isn't. Oh well. Oops. Same thing applies. Oh boy. Alright, move to shop and then we'll visit the tavern. See what the townsfolk have to say. So, weapon sword, falcon, yes. Oops. I didn't buy any new armor, did I? No, I didn't. Accessory. Oh yeah, I need to adjust those too. All right, so we made eh, roughly a good sum of our money back from selling all of our old crud that we don't need. 
Okay. Equip. Uh, for Maria. Oh, she's already at max HP, so never mind. For you, uh, I'm going to give you. Actually, I think I'll give him the balloon. For Tao, I'm going to give the magic book. What does that do again? Huge book that sends range spells by one. So give him that. Vlad's at max HP. Does everybody pretty much got a special item that they can actually make effective use of? Vlad. Increases it by eight, so yeah, giving him the other one would be a dumb idea too. That's covers actually that's one. What does the V cape do again? Actually, I think I'll increase his HP, so... Yeah, I'll give him the glove. That way he has more... Better for him to have a little bit more HP than, you know, like a slight chance to evade attacks, because normally Pike's not in the front lines anyway, so... It's kind of stupid for him to have that item. Alright then... Do an F1 save... Mm, barn Mountain Range. Oh yes, this one. That's where the enemy has a nasty ability called Dark Moon. And actually, that one's not too terribly bad, but it, it, it can be pretty annoying if you're not careful. If you're not careful. You must be careful. Okay, I think you get it. I think you get it. Alright then, so that's that saved. Wait, did I save? Sorry, I'm just double checking because... What happened earlier today just made me paranoid, like, oh shit, I just lost all my save data. Oh my god, what if this happens later on? Arr. Okay, so we'll save there. And then we'll head... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Forgot to go to the tavern. I almost forgot that. Almost. I'm only going here because there are sometimes interesting things. My prison with convicts to work. Since they're convicts, they can be worked hard with or no pay. Actually, that's kind of clever, using prisoners. That's really clever. Whoa. Have you heard about Mohoza? He's the mining prison warden. I heard he's... Oh, I can't say it. Whoa. This guy's got a serious chin. Only years are the years since Saint Nirvath's death. It will soon be 1,000 soon, and the Kudir cult claims the divine judgment will come then. King Gregor of West Natura is just a puppet. Yep, he is. Queen Mother Gatha has him under control, just like the old King France. To a degree, yes, but I think France was easier to manipulate. Gregor's just incompetent. As a France, I believe, was really, really bright, really intelligent, but I think Agatha, like... Not, I don't exactly remember what she did. But I know Gregor's just like an idiot, more or less. Like, nice guy, but he's a moron. Definitely somebody you could consider like your best friend or something, but not somebody you could consider a good leader. Because he's easy to influence, and he has like apathy towards what goes on with the war. He's like, oh, I don't care. I just don't care. I feel worthless. Slash wrists. Forever alone. Pretty much. You're one to talk. What do you think you were? You keep mountain flipping off like that, Baldy. I'll have to fix your attitude. Yes, I'm sorry. It's okay. Right, so they got those two, those two. Mr. Guy with Poison and then Mr. Guy with the Moon Spell. Eh, yeah, there's really no point, so I'll just start here. Yeah. Heal Light and Poison. Dark Moon and Blast Moon. Oh, he's only got two Dark Moons? I did not know this. Now, I'm gonna actually going to cut the video off a bit early. So I want to check on my footage, so I will see you all soon.